Oh. Yeah, but this is just the crust. This is like graphic. I just made Kavya try Arabica, Arabica coffee, whatever, I won't butcher me in the comments. But it's this place in the Grove, and they had like a tent in there, and then I, you know, I kept harassing them. I tagged them on Insta, and they were like, we're coming soon, I'm like, awesome. Like, this was my drug, okay, in Dubai, and they launched it. It's Spanish iced latte, two espresso shots, and mine's regular milk, but I made them try. Dead ass out of I don't even like that. understand coffee that well, but it's actually really good. Okay, I have an announcement. This is the last vlog from this apartment, you guys. Like, when I tell y'all, it's a wreck. When I tell y'all, it's a wreck. I mean it. So, anyways, I've been packing like crazy all week, but right now I want to go be on Auntie's podcast, so. Okay. Can you clap? Queen. We have the same beauty mark. Baby. Oh, it is really bad. Don't ask me why we have giant fat heads of football players in our garage. We need to have a little catch up. I feel like I have talked about this a little bit, only in passing on like TikTok Live and things like that, which by the way, every time I do my makeup, I pretty much go on TikTok Live. So make sure you're not missing out on those. I usually don't have a ton of people on there, so it's really easy for me to actually answer y'all specific questions let's have a little mini heart to heart before i go run these errands i am in north carolina for a little bit i put my stuff in storage my lease ended and i decided i needed to go and spend some time with my family and there are just a few things that i need to take care of over here before continuing my little los angeles love story i'm actually going back to la in a couple of weeks so I will still be back there all the time, but there's so much stuff that I want to do and I just need a second to decompress. My biggest, most important thing in life is spending time with my family. I wanna just have this time to be slowing down in terms of my environment, but speeding it up in terms of my productivity and making better content for you guys. I just got back from celebrating Jenny's birthday in Charlotte. We had so much fun. If you're familiar with Hindu holidays, right now Navaratri is taking place. My family is hosting a Golu, so we have so much work to get done. I'm currently running errands for that. And tomorrow morning, I actually need to drive to South Carolina because I have a photo shoot. So just get some last minute things, pack and prep. I will take y'all along with me. The girl who was checking me out actually asked me what lashes I'm wearing right now. These are them. I usually get them on Amazon, but I didn't have enough time. These are the Kiss Lashes in Noblesse. Needed to restock on my lash glue. This is the best lash glue in the game. This is a strip lash adhesive. It's just, it keeps your lashes on all day. I'm going to link all this stuff down below because I have had enough bad luck with lashes and lash glue and nails and nails glue. I genuinely refuse to share terrible things with you guys you could trust me okay because if i hate something i'm not going to talk about it period and then i got my favorite um lip liners these are the club hopper liners i was gonna get three but i showed some self-control and i just picked up two can i just say i'm really proud of myself because there are literally people parked right in front of me staring at me and i'm just deciding that my career is more important i woke up at 4 30 and i left my house around 6 because last night i did like my full body shower did everything i was supposed to do and um finalize and try on all of my outfits this morning i am always extra extra prepared even if i don't have time like i'll wake up super early and make sure that i'm bringing the right stuff and i really have to pee so I 
I slept at Sungby's house last night. I got there so late because the traffic from South Carolina to Charlotte was insane. Sungby and I stayed up until like 3.30 in the morning talking. This morning I woke up and went to my laser hair removal appointment. This is my fourth session and I'm not gonna lie, so far it hasn't been super painful. My second session kind of hurt and today's session kind of hurt. It was my right armpit really hurt for some reason. I am documenting my entire process. I'm giving you guys my honest feedback on what I think about laser hair removal because I was always really, really, really scared of getting laser hair removal in Beverly Hills for the past few months. And today was my first session in Charlotte. So I, I was already a little bit scared about what the dynamics were gonna be because obviously there aren't as many influencers, quote unquote, in North Carolina. But the girl said that someone had come in and done content yesterday. She's really used to it. So that was cool. I definitely did feel a little weird like filming outside. I need to just give myself exposure therapy and start vlogging and talking to you guys because you are my comfort people and I enjoy vlogging and really practicing the craft and the exercise of not caring if other people are looking at me. And then I got my mom some new shoes, sat down, had some lunch here in Charlotte. I had like a grilled chicken Caesar wrap with a salted pecan coffee, which is so sweet, you guys. Like this is giving, it's giving sugar pit. Let's hit the road. I have some hot water in my Stanley right now. It has been so long since I've been at the library. It's actually crazy. My mom gave me all three of my library passes, mine, my brother's, and hers, because we didn't know whose was whose. And the poor librarian in there, she was scanning all of the little library cards and every single one of them was expired. On top of that, my brother's card was a juvenile card, which means under like 10 or something like that. So we have not been to the library in a long time. We kind of grow up and get into the routine of life. We start working, we start pursuing our own endeavors, and we just lose sight of how important it is to continue to learn. I learn through podcasts, I learn from my friends, I learn from the people I care about, but spending time in solitude learning, like going to the library, going on tours around my town, and just doing things I wouldn't usually do is something I'm gonna try to stick to for the next couple of months. Anyways, little car rant. I'm gonna head home now. Think I'm gonna go on a walk.